Hey guys. Oh, sorry about that. Um, it's me, Vash, still here again. So, yesterday I did not upload, and it was for good reason. I didn't get a chance to record. Um, for one, and for two, I was at CoastCon 2018. So, if you guys know what CoastCon is, obviously you guys know where my area is. Uh, in that same area. So, <clears throat> but yeah, I worked as um. I worked as a volunteer security for CoastCon. Uh, my friend was the one that um, allowed me to vol to participate in the volunteer event and whatnot. And I met some really cool people. And today's today, what I was going to talk about today was a real talk, or what I was going to talk about yesterday, I should say, was a real talk about conventions. So conventions, they're they're nice. They're really nice. Um, you get to, you get to see a lot of a lot of cool people. You get to meet a lot of cool cosplayers sometimes you'll run into um some celebrities or uh some personalities some internet personalities um people that i've met at uh conventions include joey the anime man aki dearest misty connexia noble from lost paws uh nate wants to battle amelie i met them all at anime expo um either last year or the year before or the year before or the year before <laughs> but um yeah, but no, conventions, they're, they're a really nice place to go to if you're feeling like, you know, like you want to get yourself out there, but you don't want to do, like, something that's too risky or whatnot. Uh, conventions are a nice little place because it's people with a similar mindset. I'm not going to say exact same mindset because there are those outliers that will, um, that give people who watch anime a bad, or anybody who's in, like, comic books, anime, movies and whatnot. There are some people who are going to give us a bad name. Um, for the reason that they're not respectful towards staff, not respectful towards the property that the convention is being held on just because they think, oh, uh, this is in a different state from the state that I live in, I won't get fined for anything. But it's it's like, dude, come on, you're, you're ruining the convention for the rest of us. And that's like one thing, it's always going to be people who will either make it or break the convention for you. So there's a thing of... Uh, who to go with to conventions so obviously you want to go with your friends but you want to go with the ones that you know are not going to give you trouble i went with some friends my first my first year at anime expo and there was one guy who really ticked me off and and he just throughout the entire convention he was ticking me off whether we were in the car at the convention itself or at our friend's house because we were staying with our friends so he could drive us over. But he just kept ticking me off. And it was just a lot of small things that were piling up and piling up and piling up. And at the end of the convention, like, I just told him, I, I just didn't, didn't feel like even talking to him at the end of the convention. It was a really silent car ride home on the last day. And everybody could feel the tension in the car, so you really want to, you could really see, like, why it's important to choose which people you want to go to, or want to go with to the convention, I meant, sorry, not go to, but, yeah, you really want to choose the people that you want to go with, you want to really choose them carefully, um, second thing, a lot of people at conventions always forget, eat, and stay hydrated, because you need your energy for your conventions, because there's always, there's always going to be someone, that one person who, you had to end up taking care of because they weren't taking care of themselves. And there's always that one person who's so busy taking care of other people they forget to take care of themselves. <clears throat> so it's it's a lot of things like conventions. Conventions are really cool, like I said, they're really cool. You will get to meet some cool people. Sorry for the messy hair. But uh you will get to meet some really cool people. Um sometimes you might even make some new friends from it or you'll be able to volunteer at the next one or whatnot there's always going to be opportunities to be involved with the convention itself and i highly recommend you guys to either go to a convention for the first time or go back to a convention if it's been a while since you've been to one but yeah conventions they're uh, really fun really cool really nice you can see some really cool stuff you go to artist alley there's a lot of posters and whatnot and sorry i keep looking over there my dog is like standing by the door <laughs> But um, yeah, no. But it's uh, it's it's really interesting. Like a lot with conventions and whatnot, you really want to make sure like you know which panels you want to go to, know which people you want to meet, know where meetups are for certain people, 
because a lot of a lot of people, uh, a lot of personalities, uh, they're on Twitter or uh, Instagram or whatever, and they're tweeting or Snapchatting or telling people their location. So, like, hey, meet up at X W Y Z Hall in the three fifteen times, whatever you know. So if if you want to meet someone, then stay on the lookout for the information that they're giving out on their Twitters. Their Snapchats, their Instagrams, and whatnot, just so you won't you won't happen to miss them, or if you accidentally catch them, you didn't recognize them, they were in cosplay, and then you find out later they were in cosplay. It's 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 um it's really cool experience, especially like seeing all the cosplayers and like the dedication they put into um, their costume and whatnot. It's it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool stuff. Like I saw this I saw this one guy my um. Once when I went to Anime Expo a few years ago, who uh, he was in a Gundam suit made entirely out of wood, and it was pretty cool. It was pretty cool. I was like, "Oh snap, that's so cool!" Like, I don't remember. I, don't, I was like, I was like, I was walking with um with my friends, and then I just hear a clunk, and I turn around, and I'm like, "Oh no!" I don't remember which Gundam it was, but it was pretty cool, and it's just like the amount of dedication to go into building the costume and whatnot. Like, that's what I really admire from cosplayers and whatnot. And it's like, it doesn't matter your skin tone, uh, how tall you are, how short you are, your hair color, or anything. None of that stuff matters. When you're, in, when you're in cosplay, you're wearing a costume. You're there to portray the character. And if you can portray it good with, like, just the costume and whatnot, then I give you a thumbs up in my book, dude. Like, because honestly, there's... Like, it doesn't matter if it's store-bought, homemade costumes. They're pretty cool. Conventions are for showing that stuff off, you know? Showing off how you look in a costume, your favorite character, why you cosplay, or whatnot. It's, it's, that's, all, that's all conventions are. It's for people to get together and just be cool to each other, you know? But like I said, there's always going to be people that are going to bring it down and whatnot. But, yeah, other than that, some... It's a pretty fun time at conventions. You can have some really you have some really good fun there. You can meet people. Um, you can make new friends even. And conventions are just they're just cool. Like conventions are cool. I'm not gonna lie to you, they're cool. Um, sometimes it's it's a little overwhelming, especially if it's your first time. It gets a little bit overwhelming, but you feel sometimes like you feel like you belong there. And I think that's what a lot of people don't realize. What happens at conventions is that a lot of people feel that they belong there. They finally found somewhere to exist, you know. And that's that's what that's what I find pretty cool. Conventions are one of the greatest things. I'm not gonna say it's the greatest thing, but it's one of the greatest things you can do in your life. Just go to a convention, maybe just even once, check it out, and if. You don't feel like doing it ever again, then you don't have to do it ever again. But just once is just once is enough. And you know, maybe you'll find some new people, some cool people, make new friends, um, sign up for some volunteer events and whatnot. But yeah, uh, I guess that'll do it for this real talk. It was it was more like um, me. It's more like a personal kind of real talk, you know, because I was at a convention yesterday and whatnot. But, yeah. it's uh, really all I have to say. And then, hopefully I'll have <laughs> the video recorded by for this upcoming Saturday. Um, I don't know what it'll be yet, but hopefully I'll get it done. And this is Vash Deal. Signing out. See you later.